What's going on guys, we're back with a brand new video and today the Charlotte Hornets have waived Xavier Need and DJ Carton who were both on summer league training camp preseason deals. Uh, they both have been waived by the team. Now the Charlotte Hornets I believe had too many players on their team. We saw them have to waive Caleb Martin before all of this happened, before uh, the season, like the summer league, all that stuff. And then he ended up getting picked up by the Miami Heat. So uh, I'm assuming they had too many players on their roster and then they had to do this. They did add Kelly Oubre Jr. to the team and I believe they had to, that's why they waived Caleb Martin. I could be mistaken about that, but uh, they do have a lot of players on their roster. So these two, they'd have to get waived. Now, these players seem decent. Like I haven't seen too much saying that they were steals uh, in any way. I don't think either of them have ever played in the NBA, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Xavier Need, though, I'm pretty sure the same situation happened with him last year where he made the team and then they waived him before the season started, like a training camp type thing. Um, but I don't think either of them have ever played an actual game in the NBA and nothing shows me, nothing leads me to believe that they are anything crazy. I think that they are kind of just average guys that average NBA level guys that, you know, go into the go into this and you kind of expect them to get waived but you could definitely see them getting a two-way contract eventually or this happening for years upon years upon years probably for them they're both probably best suited for g league or overseas most likely overseas because it pays you more money than the g league does or maybe you'll see them get a 10-day contract or uh a two-way contract but most likely these guys will kind of keep bouncing around like this where they get signed before the season and then get waived before the season that's how these players kind of works out to happen like that and i'm assuming that is what's going to keep happening to them uh because i haven't seen anything that says they are outstanding players because obviously if they were they wouldn't have got waived by the charlotte hornets because hornets aren't that great of a team but like i said they didn't have uh, a ton of roster spots open so let me know what you guys think in the comment section below if you're hornets fans what do you guys th think about these people are they good players are they going to make another team let me know don't forget to leave a like subscribe and turn notification bells to all uh and i'll see you guys in the comments thanks so much for watching and bye peace